flooding inside the mall is creating a big mess for stores and shoppers. Good afternoon. I'm Pat Hoffman. And I'm Tara Brantley. Glenbrook Square Mall is closed until further notice. There was a water main break inside the shopping center. News Channel 15's Alyssa Ivinson joins us live now from Glenbrook with the latest on this developing story. Alyssa, what have you found out? Well, part of Glenbrook Square Mall is open to customers, and there are actually a lot of cars out here in the parking lot, but a big chunk of the mall still shut down because of that water main break. You can see behind me here at the Macy's Red Robin entrance area, still a lot of Stanley steamer trucks. Just on the other side of that, a couple more dozen restoration crews, a Stanley steamer truck here driving through the parking lot now. If we keep going toward the east, though, that is the part of the mall that's open right now, the entrance right next to Barnes in Noble, the Sears area, but inside, if you go in that entrance around Starbucks, that is where it's still shut down, and the mall's closed basically between Macy's and the J.C. Penney area. A water main break, I'm being told by a manager of some stores inside, happened uh, possibly around midnight in one of the commons areas. About 40 to 50 stores were affected. Let's take a look at some video that we got earlier this morning around 7.45. We were out here. Again, a lot of uh, crews out here cleaning out the water. Inside J.C. Penney, you can see that uh, crews are inside the, the mall now. They're, they're mopping the hallways, squeegeeing the hallways, but J.C. Penney is open. A lot of the big box stores are all open around the mall. And uh, J.C. Penney just had a little bit of damage inside. They have some fans going. One manager of a store just right outside the area affected right now said he's pretty frustrated because he can see all the customers walking by, but he can't help them. They're still mopping up water out of his store right now. And we have contacted mall officials. We're trying to find out more details about exactly when the water main break happened, how many uh, damage happened to uh, different stores, any product loss. They have not returned any of our uh, questions just yet, but again, we'll keep contacting them throughout the day, and we'll have the very latest for you throughout the day on Wayne.com and, of course, on our Twitter feed, and we'll have more live tonight at 5 and 6. Live at the Glenbrook Square Mall, Alyssa Ivinson, News Channel 15.